Margarita me please. Pina colada me please. Four hundred dollars down the drain. They say it's shot oh. o'clock. trip last night well yesterday afternoon amazing 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 if you guys have not watched that vlog you guys need to watch that vlog it's amazing the ladies i went on the trip with you guys already know them you love them follow everybody who i went on my vacation with it's amazing we already have other vacations we working on as we speak like yes follow everybody so anyways uh we're back in the routine we're back to business i'm so far behind on editing sponsor i'm not far behind on sponsorships i stockpiled all my sponsorships before i left but i don't have no vlogs to put it in because your girl ain't been editing i've barely been filming if you guys notice i think i have three travel vlogs back to back to back and i just have not been vlogging like regular vlogging so Anyways, I need to get back to basics. I need to get like stuff in order in my house. I have an exterminator on the way. Actually, I have a horrible wasp problem outside my house. Like horrible. I was about to let them keep my 10 packages that was on my door when I got home yesterday because it was crazy. Okay. Um... What else I need to do? It's just stuff around my house. I, I have been feeling, since I've moved in, because my house is still empty, y'all. Once you walk out of my bedroom, the house is empty. So I haven't even really felt like keeping up with the decorating process, if that makes sense. My room is pretty much done, but I've gotten lazy when it comes to certain stuff like I still have raw stickers on all of these pictures, those mirrors. Um, my TV is still just sitting here leaning against the wall. I need to decide whether I'm going to mount it or get the TV stand out the garage. Like, I have not watched the episode of Martin since I've been in this because I have not set nothing up. I got my cable boxes that's just been sitting out there. Ugh. The guy, I found him, he um he was a referral through my homegirl, Poe. If you guys don't watch her, watch her on here on YouTube, Ponisha Prescott. Um, he does extermination and handyman work. So he's coming over today to do extermination, but I'm going to ask him about like the handyman work because I told you guys I'm in my era of get somebody else to do it, okay? I, I like to pay for convenience. That's just where I'm at in this life. All the girls who want to do it themselves and be Barbara the Builder, more power to you. I wish I was like that. I'm not, I wish I was. I'm gonna spend the coin so I don't have to, so I can sit back and twiddle my fingers and have somebody else do it. One of my doorknobs fell off. I'm gonna see, I'm gonna ask him, how much you charge for this, this, and this? I got a doorknob, two doorknobs that I need uh, put on, uh, hooking up my cable boxes, which I know all it is is just plugging shit in, but sir, if you're here, <laughs> come on I'm, i'll pay you to do it so but anyways guys this was just a check-in um the kids start school tomorrow so i will be picking them up from their dad's house this evening uh i was gonna pick them up yesterday but ashton had a hair appointment she got her hair in twists ethan's getting his hair in twists today so i'll be picking them up later on this evening and my babies are gone. It's officially school time. Summertime is over. I will be traveling less and at home more and saving money. The amount of money I've been spending on traveling this summer is ridiculous. Let's, let, let's not even discuss it. Y'all, my baby just got his ears pierced. He looks so cute. Oh my God. Y'all going to see him in person today, but his dad just sent me these. Look at my baby. He's so handsome. Y'all don't pay attention to my nails. I was just looking at how crusty they look. But y'all know, after vacation, my last day of vacation, I literally bite them off. 
Oh my God. He looked like he took it like a G. <laughs> He's been asking for a while. He, well, he started asking probably towards the beginning of the year to get his ears pierced. And we told him, okay. And then he changed his mind. And then he asked again recently. He wanted them pierced for school. I just wish, because school starts tomorrow. I wish we had got them pierced like earlier in the summer so they'd be healed. But, oh, he looks so cute. My oldest, Byron, he got his pierced at 10. Now, Ethan got his pierced at 12. So, the, um, the exterminator's here. He's starting on the outside of the house. And then he said he's going to come inside. Yeah, it, as soon as he rang the doorbell, the wasp started attacking. I'm like standing in the doorway, like door cracked like this. I'm like, okay, all right, whatever you do, 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 do your thing, sir. Do your thing. I'm like ducking and dodging. Like I refuse to let one of them come in here and fly with these high ceilings and be stuck up there buzzing around and I can't sleep. No, no, indeed, no. All right, y'all, we about to open some packages. I opened most of them yesterday, but not all. So I actually, what I'm gonna show y'all, I opened up a lot more. I've already put it away. I just didn't think it was worth saving. So it, it was like Shein stuff, like some Shein jewelry, Shein bracelets. Um, what else did I get? A bunch of packages for the kids, like a bunch of back to school clothes, shoes. Y'all ain't wanna see that. Anyway, I'm just gonna show y'all the stuff that I thought was worth showing you guys. Um, I do have a sponsorship coming with Thread Up, y'all. I love Thread Up. I, I I had never heard about them. I had I, well, let me not say I hadn't heard about them on my banking app. I'm always getting um, like an advertisement to if I bought something from Thread Up, I get like a rebate on my banking app. And then I think I had seen like um, this girl called Do It on a Dime. I love her channel. Love her channel. She does sponsorships with Thread Up. Anyway, it's like a resale online clothing boutique. So if you guys have stuff that you guys don't want, you can send it to Thread Up and then they'll resell it for you and then they send you the check for it. Anyways, I have a sponsorship with them coming up. But I'm saying all that to say I love them so much. I bought stuff on my own, okay? <laughs> they got all the Zara stuff and a lot of their Zara stuff uh, like shoes are my size i'm a size 39 if it's closed till i wear 40 but y'all i found these on there brand new still with the tag attached it says 90 dollars and y'all know a little kitten meow meow but i plan on wearing these with like some long pants so all you're gonna see is the pointy toe anyway you're not gonna see the kitty meow meow but y'all these was i think i paid 25 dollars for these yes super cute you know all right so what was i saying essence i love those websites where you can buy designer stuff for cheaper i shop on essence satire guilt netta porter my Teresa. um it's a bunch of them that sells brand new uh designer stuff for the lolo and then i also follow those pages on instagram that does like bargain hunting for you for designer stuff. That's how I found this one. The guy who I follow is called Chasing Luxuries. And so he posted this, it was 70% off. Oh, Jacquemus. Did I show y'all? I don't think I showed y'all my other Jacquemus bag that I got last week. I wasn't vlogging. I was it the week before that. Oops. Anyways, I'm not gonna, it's upstairs. It's a, it's a vacation bag and it looks very similar to this, and it's hot pink. But y'all look at this, a chocolate brown Jacquemus bag, but baby, it's the handle. Y'all look how cute this freaking bag is. I don't have a chocolate brown bag in my wardrobe, so this is perfect. I have, I'm about to say my Louis Vuitton bags, those don't count. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. And if it's on my shoulder too, walk away like this, bitch. Walk away like this, girl. Yes. Okay. So this was, like I said, this was 70% off. So this was a $900 bag. 
and I got it for $220, something like that. And like I said, the other one that I didn't show y'all on camera that I got a week or two ago looks exactly like this, but it's um, hot pink with a hot pink strap. And that one was 70% off also. So you guys, if y'all don't have Essence, y'all download them. Now these I paid full price for from my Teresa. Anyways, I got some Loewe sunglasses. Um, about to say, I was gonna show y'all the packaging, but I think I threw that away already. Some dainty little sunglasses, like, to me, super understated. Of course, that's the logo. Y'all know Lueva isn't one of those. It's not like a Gucci. where Everybody sees Gucci and like Louis Vuitton and they know what it is. Lueva is more understated. That's why I love them. So I thought these were really cute. Just some brown sunglasses with the logo. Mm -hmm. Then I got another item from another i can't remember it's this new one they're, they're called like madison avenue or something i just started following them on instagram i do want to give a shout out to miss jamima she put me on to them <laughs> so yeah so they posted this emilio Pucci skirt that was i believe 70 percent off also the link was to netta porter and this is a cover-up sarong. So all it is, a sarong ain't nothing but just a big ass scarf, but it's the Emilio Pucci print and it says Emilio Pucci really little on it, kind of understated, which I'm kind of into now, just little tiny logos. So, you know, you can wear it. Cover-up skirt like this. You can wear it like, this tied up up here or I don't know like this but y'all know me I might wear it as a scarf on my head y'all know I love scarves for vacation I am a scarf girl wear like this on vacation uh, margarita me please pina colada me please okay yeah, so this was, I believe, original price was like 500 and something. And I think I got it for 170. I'm almost positive it was 170, so. Okay, y'all, so I came home to five boxes that say Auntie G on the top. And you guys already know who calls me Auntie G, Kino and Fitz. They had hit me up um, probably about a week or two ago, about two weeks ago, saying, hey, what's your new address? We want to send you a housewoman gift. And I get all of this? So two packages came the first day, then the next day another package came, and then more packages came the day after. I was like, what are y'all doing? Oh my God. So we're about to open these on camera. I should call them. Should I call them? What time is it? I'm gonna call them afterwards. What we got, what we... Ow! A double layer toothbrush holder. Hold on, how do I open this? Picture on the outside right here. So if it's in the corner of your sink, you can put your toothbrushes in here and I guess like skincare, toiletries and stuff in there. This is so nice, thank you. Oh my gosh, it feels like Christmas. <laughs> A cool mist humidifier. Y'all, Ethan needs this actually. Ethan has allergies. Y'all know, I talk about his allergies all the time. Ethan needs this. Thank you guys. This is going in my baby's room and it's small because the last humidifi humidifier we had was massive. I didn't understand why it was so huge. This right here is gonna be the perfect size. This is, <gasps> bitch, I wanted one of these. I wanted one of these. Uh, silicone ice cube molds. 
Wait up. Yes. 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 Yes, yes, and yes. We about to fill this up right now. <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna wash them first and then fill them up. But this is what they are. Oh, this is so cute. Okay, so that's a rose, a diamond. Oh, I love this. These are just big balls and then big squares. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. My friends just know me. Oh, I'm gonna reuse this bag. They barely even use. And they got the little nice sticky stuff right here. Y'all know somebody came in my house and stole all my mailers. I told y'all that story a month ago. We got, oh, it doesn't say anything on the box. Let me lay this, lay this all nice out, because I'm, I'm telling y'all I'm keeping this. Shit. Hold that thought, the exterminator's knocking on my door, so we'll be back. Y'all, it's been a few hours. The pest control guy came on the inside and started doing the inside of the house. I washed dishes, I made some lunch. I had to go off on this company that sent me something that was supposedly delivered two weeks ago. Y'all, I had to put in a two claims on these websites that a kid sent me that they wanted clothes from. So it's been a few hours. It's been like two. Yeah. What is it? Something glass maybe because I see styrofoam. so cute oh this is so cute why was i on timu today today y'all looking at these they were a little bit different they had a little spout the only difference was they had a spout and they were colored this is for orange juice right right this is for my orange juice or is it i wish it had like a little card i feel like Oh, look at this little set. This is so cute. Or maybe for people who juice, you put your juice in here and then you can just pour little eight ounce cups of it. I don't know, but this is so cute. It's just crazy how I was, I was literally just looking at these. Last box from them. heavy it says elevated life adventures this box is pretty Let's see i always think it's something glass when they have the styrofoam on top what is it what is it <gasps> drinking glasses oh wow oh yes indeed oh yes I'm gonna have cute cocktails now, y'all. And like I said, it's been so long that I even used the, uh, the ice trays have been sitting in here for like two hours. Oh, they're done, are they ready? I think they might be ready. Oh no, the squares aren't. These feel ready. Nice. And a shot. And a shot glass, y'all. This is so pretty. I just feel so loved. All this stuff. Thank you so much, Kino and Fitz. I love you guys so much. You guys just don't even understand. Like, literally, when y'all came into my life, like, a year ago. Well, at this point, it's been like a year and a half. I just, I never would have thought our friendship would have blossomed into what it is today. And it's like, we're actual friends outside of social media. Like when we talk, have our long conversations, I'd be on FaceTime with them. Like, I'd be like, let me tell y'all what happened. What should I do? You know, just literal friends. I just, I just never thought 
that it would just be, I thought it would just be like, oh, okay, yeah, they cool. We're going to say our high and buys on social media, comment on videos, on pictures, and that's that. But it has just blossomed into so much more than that. And it's just truly a blessing. And I just, I love you guys so much. Um, you guys mean the world to me. And I miss y'all so much. I really wish, oh my God. I just really wish that, um, you know, I just wish the best for you both, for your careers, for your relationship, just everything. I just, I really appreciate y'all so much. You just don't understand, like, just the genuine conversations that we have, the laughs, everything. <sighs> just thank you guys. I just, I didn't even expect this. I, I literally didn't. When y'all hit me and were like, oh, we want to send you a housewarming gift. You know, I had no clue what it was going to be, but I just did not expect all this. Y'all really put thought into these gifts. And these are things that I'm actually going to use. Like, thank you so much. Whoo, okay. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. And I'm going to come back and I'm going to open the other box. But hold on, y'all. Give me a second. Okay, y'all. We're back. We back. Ta-da! Okay, so this is from Neom. What is it? Escape Summer Wellness. Feel the absolute best all season long with our travel collection. Keep calm on the go with our calming hand bomb. So we got Perfect Night Sleep Mist. Oh, it's a pillow and body mist. Okay. A mini oil diffuser. Wow, okay. Y'all, this is perfect for your nightstand. Probably sit in the cup holder in my car too. Next we have, okay, so this is the oil for the oil diffuser. It's English lavender, sweet basil, and jasmine. I bet that smells good. Oh, these are the travel essentials, okay. A hand balm, body butter, and a great day wonder bomb. So I guess this is all just like lotions. Okay, thank you, Neom. We love that. What you need to know about black folks is we love a color coordinated Y'all look at this. Community -based. I just made a reel. <laughs> I heard this uh, sound on Instagram. How do you get sounds on TikTok too? So I saved the video, but it said save without audio. It's not like it's a copyrighted song. It's this girl, Gigi LaFlair, who I follow. What you need to know about black folks is we love a color-coordinated, community-based group activity. That's them. That's, that's who we are. That's how you know we truly involved. Was there a color scheme set up? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Because one thing about it, at the family reunion, we're going to have a matching shirt. On a girl's trip, we gon' have a matching evening outfits and bathing suits. On a vacation, we gon' color coordinate. If he wears a floral leaf print outfit from Fashion Nova, I'ma wear a florally bathing suit. We gon' match, okay? Everybody is going to match. That's just what we do at the black events. <laughs> because if there was no matching pictures, did it really happen? Hmm. First day of school. Y'all heard of this brand? Do y'all kids wear this brand, Euphoric? They both made me buy them multiple hoodies from this overpriced brand. And it's really but worth But of course, it. mom did it. Mom came in clutch. <laughs> yes. Hoodies in 90 degree weather, 100 degree weather, yeah. He got two strand twists in his hair. He got his ears pierced and he don't want to be on camera. He looks so handsome. Mm-mm-mm. Yeah, I want to be on camera. Okay, it's time to go. Let's drop these kids off for their first day. At the new school, Ashton's first day of middle school. Girl, you better oh, leave that here. No. Leave it here. Leave it here. It would, but leave it. We are about to get these lashes done. I'm contemplating getting bottom lashes. I've gotten bottom lashes one other time, and I really liked them, but I didn't like how when I would blink, it's like my top lashes would get intertwined. 
so a lot of times when i blink i would have to like pull them apart that was hella annoying does that happen to any of y'all when y'all get bottom lashes too anyways i just booked the trip <laughs> so i'm going somewhere this weekend you know your girl stays on the go so i'm gonna try to freshen up my hair later get a pedicure lashes get ready for the weekend traveling again y'all i like the way that this other lady does my lashes more my girl's out of town so i had to go back to another lady that i had previously used and i like the way she does them better but uh, they're super full right now so they're gonna actually look like how i really really want them in like day day three day three is when they start looking like perfection but i can already tell by the shape and everything that they're gonna look so good how do you fire your person <laughs> she's so sweet she is like the sweetest but i know you're not supposed to think about stuff like that when business and money is involved <sighs> It's like I want chicken, but I don't want Chick-fil-A. I'm, I'm a little burnt out on Chick-fil-A. I went and mind Popeyes, but I don't think there's a Popeyes in this area. I go to Arby's and get a chicken wrap. I know y'all hate Arby's. Everybody hate Arby's. They got some good French fries. They got some good chicken wraps. They got some good chicken sandwiches. They got a barbecue brisket sandwich that comes out like once a year. That's amazing. Them little roast beef sandwiches, I don't fool with those. But they other sandwiches, they even had a burger at one point. The burger was good. I'm in the outlet mall with my little buddy here. <laughs> Ethan's at um, basketball practice. So this is the only um, mall that's the closest to us with a Nike store. And I had a few returns from that I bought online that I returned in store. So while we're here, we're gonna check out the cosmetics company store. I don't need anything. I don't need perfume. I definitely don't need makeup. I to the store. I did meet a subscriber here. Cosmetics company store. Where I get all my Tom Ford. MAC eyeshadow for five dollars. More MAC stuff. This is 75% off. Becca for 75% off. That looked like it might be my color. Joe Malone's, not all, but you know, some. This stuff is so good. The lotion. We have the Restoration Hardware Outlet. Girl. What the? It's so entertaining. Let's look at Restoration Hardware Outlet. Not like I can buy anything. Huh. The couches are very nice and simple. These chairs are nice. How much are these? Good lord, that's hot. For that? How much is this? Are they comfy? Oh, it's comfy. It is? That's comfortable? Be careful on these people. White furniture. <laughs> Everything looks the exact same. Like, there's no... Everything's like white and cream. You ready? I know, that's probably why this is in here because they all have like little marks on them. I'm crazy boys. I'm gonna dedicate 20 minutes and that's all I got because this is a lot of store. Extra 50% off our swimsuits. Mm, okay, we're gonna take a look. Oh, I need another Jamaica trip. Look at this bathing suit. How much is it? $13. Half of that. Should I get it for manifestation purposes? This is cute. Y'all know I love bathing suits like this. How much is this? Child, I'm about to be stocked up on bathing suits. I am already don't need not another. Why would any woman want to wear this? I know it's a gag, but still, why? Okay, y'all. 
Let's see what I'm gonna get. I just got all the cute ones that were in my size. Extra large. See, this one's cute, white with the silver on the top. But I don't think the boob part is gonna work. That boob part's not gonna work, so this is a no. And this one, it has like a tie in the middle. They're all connected, so it's hard to see, but this one should work because of the cut of the, of the top. And it's a little thotty. We like that. Now this one is like a mom bikini because it has the thick edges, full, full coverage at the top. And the top is that one, it's a one like that. I'm gonna get this for like a kid's vacation. So we're gonna get that. And this one I think is a mom bikini too. But I remember the bottoms of this one were like full coverage also. Thick bands, full coverage, and it's a one piece. So it goes like this. Is this a mom bikini? Hold on. This one's only $9, so it'd be $4.50. We're gonna get this one, we're gonna make it work. Here's a green one. This one should be good. I'm really into solid color bathing suits right now. This one I picked up just because it was a matching set. A lot of these back here are just single pieces and you gotta mix and match yourself. I don't like that. Okay, this is our manifestation bikini. So we are gonna go ahead and get this one. Not bikini, but bathing suit. Manifesting another Jamaica trip with a new boo. <laughs> and then here's, I love this cut of bikini. It's a one piece, but I love this. Now, I like the color of this one, but the material is, can y'all see? It's like a tank top material, but then the inside is lined. So this is gonna get dirty very easily because of the material. We're gonna pass on it. This one, I couldn't figure out how it goes. I feel like it goes like across like this. Okay, I think it does. I think that's how this one goes. Across like this. So this one's on the pass. Now I saw this one, I thought this one was just a fun one, but y'all know I don't wear like super colorful like this, but I thought, I thought it would be a cute fun bikini to wear. And I can get funky with like a knit hat, colorful knit hat, colorful jewelry. I don't have nothing like this so even though I'm in my like solid colors I think we're gonna get that and then this is the last one because it's more neutral but it's a 3x so that's what's throwing me off is the size the top will fit for sure because it's adjustable but these bottoms are not and that's what's throwing me off should I put these over my leggings and see we're about to see They look baggy on the booty. <laughs> if they baggy on the booty, and I'm wide, so I don't know, but I love the color. But I could tie it up on the hips a little bit to make it tighter. We're gonna let this one marinate. We're gonna, we gonna think about this one as we look around a little bit more. Hey y'all, happy Thursday. I'm picking y'all up late in the day because I have been working since I dropped my kids off at school. This morning, I got back home around, I don't know, like 8.40, and I started working around like 9 a.m. And here it is, almost four o'clock, and I'm just now stopping because I have to pick the kids up from school. <laughs> I'm about to open up this sponsorship real quick because I'm gonna probably film when I get back. Y'all, I just, this vlog, I hope you guys enjoy it. By now, you would have already watched the vlog because I believe, yes, it's going to come out before this. My girl's trip to Loom vlog. Four hours of footage, y'all. Four hours. I started at 9 a.m. 
Like I said, it's basically four o'clock. I took one break for like 30 minutes and that's it. Y'all, I have edited four hours of footage down to two and a half hours so far in the whole day. Like out of this, I don't even know what I'm trying to do. I'm like delirious right now, but I still probably have like three more hours of editing to do or more. Uh, I told you guys I have a sponsorship with Thread Up. I freaking love, love, love them. Let me get some scissors. Hold on. And you guys probably would have seen this sponsorship by the time this video goes out too, if I'm able to stay on track <laughs> with the sponsors. But anyways, like I was saying, y'all, just the editing sucks, and I'm not gonna pay anybody to edit because I have my own style of editing, and then. It'd be a lot of stuff I want to cut out because when I pick up my camera sometimes, especially on vacation, baby, I will buckle water man, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm not sending that to an editor. Lazar kitty meow meow. What is this? Oh, I got a Zara bikini. Lululemon top. Okay. I think I got a lot of Zara stuff. Cause I think this is Zara. I'm almost positive this is a Zara bag. Yep, Zara. I thought this would be cute for vacation. Just a little simple, cheap black leather bag. Oh, this is that heavy, thick quality. Oh my God. This dress weighs like five pounds. Oh my goodness. What name brand is this? Hanifa. <gasps> a Hanifa dress? Y'all, y'all a Hanifa. I did not know this was a Hanifa dress. I just saw, I just typed in blue midi dress because I wanted to get like workout stuff. Of course, like swimwear and then like going out stuff. <gasps> Y'all, this dress was like $10. Y'all, this dress was 10 How much are Hanifa dresses? I be seeing the uh, Instagram girls with their Hanifa dresses on. Hold on, let me go to Hanifa. Child, what? Y'all, this dress was 10 This dress was $10. I know it was. This dress was $10. Here go a dress for $300. A dress for $300. A set for $320. Oh, this shirt's cute. Jeans for 300. I got a Hanifa dress. Ah, and I didn't even know it. Oh, wow. Okay. Wow. <gasps> Some Nike sneakers. I think these were like $20. Child, these probably was only worn one time. Look, don't have nothing at the bottom of them. Another Zara bag. I said this would be nice for vacation. It's kind of big though. Dang, I didn't know it was that big. Still cute though. Has a clutch. Anyways, y'all check out my review with them. The coupon code and everything will be in that video. Like I said, I don't know if it's going to be in this video or the video before this. I'm not really sure. But anyways, let me go um, pick the kids up. I'm cooking dinner tonight, so no one has practice today, thankfully. I still have to pack. Lord. I be feeling like it ain't enough hours in a day. I think I say that in almost every vlog. It ain't enough hours in the day. It's enough hours in the day. Let me say that. It is definitely enough hours in the day. I just don't do time management properly. That's what it is. We in Wale 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 We're a Wale A Wale A Wale We're a Wale A Wale A Wale We're grocery shopping The kids needed their school supplies today They said they cannot wait another day Today That's what we're doing Ooh hummus mm. See, This is why I don't like coming in store grocery shopping What happened? I hit my head How? And I hit my chin right here I was, I was setting it down and then it hair hit her Oh my mom would have loved this Smokehouse burnt ends. It's almost my mama's birthday too, so in memory of her, we we gonna buy this. <laughs> That's my excuse. Okay. Fried pickle ranch dip. Yeah. Ooh, fried pickle ranch dip. 
What? Hold on. See, I'm not coming in stone no more. This is it. Slow cooker sausage? Wait a minute. Slow cooker sausage and cheese? Oh, my gara. Bootlegger beer? What? Y'all, okay, let me walk away. I'm getting those two dips and then I need to find some, um, I need to dip them in some freaking vegetables at this point. That does sound good, no? It, it's- Y'all, I guess we're rolling into fall. The pumpkin stuff is out, even though it's 106 degrees outside in Texas. Grab something, baby. Oh, this looks good. Chocolate croissants? Yeah. Yeah, I want this. Oh, and it... And you better eat them, too. Oh, and it comes in, like, mini packets? Okay. Y'all, I did smothered chicken with rice. I did not have any more um, broth, which I didn't realize. So I had to use regular water with bouillon, which is fine. It still flavors your rice really good, but... I like using broth. I usually make wings. Legs were on sale, so that's what we did. We got legs. And I smothered it the lazy way. If you know, you know, you know how to do lazy smothered chicken. <laughs> Y'all, this dip was nasty, okay? The burnt ends dip, terrible. It literally does not taste how it, the title of it sounds at all. Now the dill pickle ranch, or not the dill pickle, the uh, fried pickle ranch, amazing. Me and Ethan was tearing it up. This, a waste of $6. Doing some croissants with them. It's like, I think it's everything, all butter, everything croissants, yeah. So like everything bagel, it has the seasoning on there. So I'm gonna heat these up. For the kids. Well, myself too, of course. Y'all, this is the corn that I made. It's so, this brand is good. It's so good and seasoned to perfection. And this is denim. It ain't played at all pretty, but trust me, it's gonna be busting. Y'all wanna know what's crazy? I've never lost a clothing item. I know I hear people all the time say, oh, I misplaced a jacket, a shirt, I can't find anymore. I left something at so-and-so's house and I never seen it again. I done lost a cell phone, a purse. I've never lost anything. Never, ever. I don't even think I've ever lost money before. Y'all, I cannot find my Loewe tank top. I brought it to New York. I wore it in New York. And I must have left it in New York. I have not seen that shirt since. Now, granted, I have not looked for it since, but when I was out there packing, it just dawned in my head like, where's my Loewe tank top? And I came over here. It's not in my closet, y'all. I must have left that in the hotel room. 300, 400, I'm about to say $300 shirt. No, that tank top was $400 <laughs> with tax because it's been months now when did i go to new york for keenan fitz's birthday in may here we are august where is my shirt that four hundred dollars down the drain i can't believe it yo this is crazy wow i i oh wow I'm lying. I have lost something before. My two Louis Vuitton bracelets. So this is becoming a trend. When I move, I lose something designer. Like, now those Louis Vuitton bracelets, if you guys remember, it's when I moved into my other house. I moved all of my designer stuff with me. I didn't load anything on the moving truck. I was like, this is my, you know, stuff. I'm moving it in my car with me. Have not seen them since the day I packed them up and put them in my car. I'm thinking I may have possibly 
put them in like a shoe box or something and I stacked all those shoe boxes up and thrown them away. That's the only thing logical in my head. I don't know why I would just put those two items in a shoe box and throw them away when I had other small um, luxury items. But that's my only rationale because where would they be? I, 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 I looked everywhere. I looked in all my purses. I looked in my shoes. I looked in pockets of jackets. I looked everywhere. Y'all know the story for those of you that have been watching me. And now this, I haven't seen it since the other house. I'm just now realizing it. <sighs> what is up, y'all? So, y'all, today is a travel day. I am headed back to Chicago. Y'all know I was just there two weeks ago for my uncle's 80th birthday. I am headed again. Portia is having a yacht party. Um... So she did a meet and greet with the ladies of Chicago a few weeks ago, and she's connecting with them again to do a yacht party. And she invited me, and I was actually free this weekend. Surprising, I didn't have anything planned. And it's the kids weekend with their dad, so all the cards just fell right. I had an airline credit, like literally everything just aligned perfectly. So here we are. I'm headed to the airport and I'm doing something I ain't never done before y'all can y'all guess what it is you ain't gonna be able to guess what it is but anyways we're gonna have like a slumber party at Portia's house <laughs> I'm staying at Portia's house so I'm so excited surprisingly I'm not getting a hotel which I'm happy about that because I'm saving some money your girl has been traveling every weekend this entire summer so hotels add up flights add up so to save a little coin and we're gonna have like a little slumber party lily is coming also so it's the three of me guys <laughs> so it's gonna be fun it's gonna be a nice fun weekend um this is gonna be my first time going to chicago and not seeing my family i'm Ch portia doesn't live directly in chicago i think she said that she lives almost an hour away from the city so i will not be commuting back and forth to see family I, I just saw everybody two weeks ago i would love to if i was able to carve out some time to go stop by my mom's grave i just don't think that it's gonna happen i don't know we'll see i'm only here for 48 hours i landed 2 p.m today and then i go back home uh 1 p.m on sunday so actually a little bit less than 48 hours so yesterday I went to um, the CCS and I bought some tinted moisturizer and I'm wearing it today and I just don't know how I feel about it. I feel like, I feel like I have on foundation with nothing else. So y'all let me know what to do with tinted moisturizer to make it not look like foundation. I, maybe I put too much, that might be it. I might have put too much. Maybe I can just put a little bit in my fingers and rub it on my face. I literally put it on my face like I'm doing my foundation. I don't know. It don't look bad, but it don't look great. That's what I'm going to say. <laughs> yeah. And if y'all have a CCS in your area, yesterday they were doing six items for $60. The entire store. The only uh, stuff that was excluded was Tom Ford and Lamar. Let me turn this off because I know where I'm going. I don't even know why I be having Exit right to J having this on. I go to the airport every freaking week. I should know my way. I actually, I use my GPS to get to the airport just because it don't let me know of detours of where there's like bad traffic and stuff like that. So I actually like to look at it. So I'm a little early for my flight. So you already know I'm in the Centurion Lounge to get some breakfast and cocktails. Cause how do I have to start off a trip? Drinking, of course. Duh. This is what we got. Potatoes, sausage, eggs, pancakes, a little pound cake. I don't know. Just made it to my plane. I'm literally sweating. I don't know if because I was rushing or this <laughs> tinted moisturizer. But y'all, there's no TVs. I need to get work done anyway, so it's cool. And best believe, I'm about to eat again on this flight, okay?
Okay, let me walk. I just see terminal one, two, and five. I don't see like no letters. I'm gonna have to ask somebody. Oh, I see G. I see it. I see G. Oh yeah, because it's telling me to walk out. We made it. Well, concourse. Now it don't say concourse G. It don't say concourse G in the elevator now, but the sign on the outside of the elevator. Yeah, I'm at baggage claim. Hold on, let me get off the elevator. Check. Yeah, I'm at the lower level. I'm I'm terminal two. Yeah, that was a mess. <laughs> I got the elevator, got off the elevator. Oh, look at the little birdie. Oh. I didn't see it. I, it was confusing. Huh? And you got your thing holding yourself. I got it ready. I ain't mad You know, I was when I was packing, I was thinking that I was like, I got her luggage. I wonder if she got me a replacement. <laughs> oh, let me go on this side. <laughs> Girl, your car nice. Hi, Lily. Hey, truly. Yeah, I'm ready for uh, the three amigos weekend. <laughs> We in the liquor store getting the party started, y'all. Oh, the grenadine. This liquor store is very happy. You got grenadine? I feel like I got it. Oh, yeah. You can ask me which one. I feel like I got grenadine. Look what I'm buying, y'all. It's a drink that uh, Lily says we're going to make, so. <laughs> y'all know I don't drink dark. 244. Goddamn glad. Goddamn Jack O'Blast. Caribbean oh, rum with spice. Oh, that sounds good. Dark one, right? I know my battery about to die. Lord. Thank you. Thank you. Get a receipt. Yes. Okay. Yeah, we need to write this off. Yeah. Thank you. Bye, bye. You said bye. He said bye, baby. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. okay. <laughs> Is that a new? Is that a new boo? Yeah. So we for uh. Really? Is that what you want? Is that what you want? We started Saint drinking Tropez already, y'all. Oh. You she said Saint Tropez. <laughs> That's Cabo. What? You was in Cabo? Well, no. Where is Saint Tropez? I don't know. Cause oh, I ain't been there. Cause, Cause you know Cabo is Saint Jose. Yeah. Yeah. This Moscato no, is so good. Monday. Y'all, Portia's apartment is so cute. It's so cute. It is, it is decorated family. so nice. Yes. Three bedrooms. She only showed y'all a small part of it. It yeah, is so nice. Yeah, y'all might nice. try to Google my layout. <laughs> That's what I be scared of. But she got, she got that heat in every corner. I'm just yes. saying. Y'all know what I'm talking about. <laughs> every corner. And Kia be like, we be leaving. Kia be like, you got your guns? <laughs> I do. Yeah. Be they, like, they, I know you can make a gun. They just out sitting out. She, she don't have no babies anymore. here, so don't worry about it. But yeah. they, they out. Okay. We walked in the house so don't like, try it. Gun. Gun right. everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> no, man. Uh. People. <laughs> they look like Fourth of July shots. So full. Right there. Fire. What are those little popsicles called? Drinks. Drinks. Okay. Let's okay. so get a check. Mom, right. you want she won't want one. <laughs> you can tell. Because I was like, I didn't want to drink the chicken. I had a white. So she's put in hypnotic so far and Malibu. Oh, yeah, she this said this is the top of it. Right now, they look ugly and it's cold. <laughs> this one looks cute, though. Yes. <laughs> but it's the nighttime. It's okay. We still gonna use them. Yeah. We'll still use them. It's like a hundred of them this night. Y'all, look how cute she made this drink. And it's like layered. Yeah, that's how Look it at goes. this. <laughs> Take a, oh, here, take a picture of it, Lily, for your um. You should take a picture of it and then list the ingredients for like your um on Instagram, Instagram. story, yeah. Okay. Cause that's the only cute one. That's the one that came out cute, <laughs> yeah. yeah. 
Oh, it's kind of cute. You think so? Yeah. It is, yeah. It's cute. Oh, you got a whole thing right here. Oh, there you go. Cute background, yeah. I still got a butt. She still got a whole lot of butt. She be acting like I'm disappearing. No, can, she's lost a lot of weight. I can lose about 20 more pounds. Damn. I you said, where the 20 gonna go? Where, what, what's all this? Okay. <laughs> we should be on live. Okay. It's time for the taste test. Oh, let me see. I need to mix it up. But it's so it pretty. But I'm gonna You can still taste the liquor. Just drink it. Just drink it. Okay. That's good. Let me mix it up now. So I can taste yeah, the so you taste everything. Mm -hmm. You want to taste? I don't even taste the hint. Mm. This is going to be lethal right here. Yeah. <laughs> I I actually, uh, Portia you. and Kia is but, teaching us yeah. about these live uh, streaming now, apps. I really if you really want she said when that was popping during the PPP lie. era, yeah, you know, pandemic wow. era. Because it is but, a, a but now, They tell me about all this money they made, how they made the money, like the little like sneaky they used to do to get the people. But to, now, so we need to talk about what time we're going out. What time we're going out? Because what time is it? Actually, what time we going outside? Who is they? Yes, man, I'm about to face you. Okay. Right it's six o'clock, so what time? What's a good time for Chicago? Can you hear me? Y'all, we just sit here being lit. I'm fucking on my drink. This strong. It's really God strong. Damn. <laughs> and you was already drinking. I was already drinking. I had already drank on the airplane. And then when we came in here, we got some Moscato. And then she made this strong. Mixing the liquors, the clear and the brown. Yeah, so this is how much I've, I've only drank this, and it tastes really good. It does. But y'all, I feel I don't want to get too soon because we're going out tonight. What so. time are we outside? Fucking Portia. What time are we outside? <laughs> <laughs> what time are we outside? <laughs> <laughs> don't have time to twerk. You want to? I've seen it. Girls weekend. Yes. Ghost is. He adorable. He found he, a friend. Okay, right. So we, we, you go to he wanted to rumble with Lily. I came straight in. <laughs> he did. I came. He was just humping me. No, we did. He was just humping me. I said. He's a humper. He's a humper. Yeah, we don't want to Walmart. 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 Yeah, we don't but I got me some little General Joe's chicken rice, wing, shrimp. Mm hmm. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. What's next? Chicago Life. And Ghost waiting on something to hit the ground. Didn't you just get out of the hospital, sir? What? Bullshit in the hospital for him? Okay, y'all. Uh, I'm back. I don't even remember the last time y'all saw me. It is 9.20. We are getting ready for the night. We are going somewhere called Y Bar. Why my lips look so dry and white? Anyways, yeah, we're going somewhere called Y Bar. I only bought one dressy outfit, and I think it's, like, too dressy. Like, it's for, like, a... If we went to, like, a bougie steakhouse. You know what I'm saying? It's a maxi dress all the way down to my ankles with some green heels and a green bag it's not club bar you know then the other two outfits that i brought are more chill because they're like two pieces but i brought them to wear with sandals so i didn't bring like a in-between outfit and it's like blowing me but we're gonna make it do what it do so i'm about to do my makeup this setup in this room. This is my room, but I ain't even show y'all the room. This is my room, by the way. Super cute. Portia got three three bedrooms. Cute, girl. Decorated, nice. Okay. So I'm sitting in front of the vanity right now. Um, this makes me want to finish the vanity area in my room upstairs. Okay. Cause y'all already know. 
I just put everything on pause. Like, for the first like three weeks of me being in my house, I was so gung ho about getting everything set up and ready and shopping every day and this and that. Baby, after a while, I said, screw this. I just gotta get back to it. I just gotta get back in my mode, my mojo. Anyway, let me put a little bit of makeup on this face. I can't believe how good my hair has stayed. I got my hair done a week and a half ago. Yeah, a week and a half ago. And it still looks like so flat and perfect. Child, we rocking this till the wheels fall off. <laughs> I'm joking, because I got other hair sponsorships to do. So we probably gonna rock this for about another week or less. Okay, y'all, this is the face of the night. Hair, of course, the same. Um, she in chunky earrings, Skims bandeau top, brown gaucho pants from, I think one of them little, not I think, it's like a little fast fashion store in Houston. And then I'm wearing my tan Chanel bag. Hold on, hold that thought. Okay, y'all, so this is how the full outfit looks. Nothing too crazy. You know how I dress. And then this is the bag that I'm wearing. It's the show. Our coaches matter. And he's like 12. Oh, no. You got little kids already. Oh, hey, Google. He's a grown ass man with two kids, kids, but he looks 12. Hey, Google. Pause music. They say it's yes, shot o'clock. I, I still need to chase him off. Okay. I can shoot that. I don't want nobody to know. I can shoot that. 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 Because I put Hennessy in the Malibu. Period. <laughs> Up to it. Down, down to, to it. it. Those who don't, don't do, do it. it. We do it because we used to, to it. it. So drink. Okay. Drink. Nova and then Hermes bracelet, my little bangly, um, Louis V bag, Loewe glasses, and Christian Dior earrings. Hey, uh, looking good. <laughs> Y'all, this is Kia. She's new to the channel. Yes. Um, well, well, I'm not oh, I'm not coming. No, I'm, it's not ready yet, Kia. Kia, quit standing like that. <laughs> she's taking a deep breath. She's serious. Quit standing like that. Check. I forgot what I was wearing. Where <laughs> your shirt from? Oh, oh shoes. Shirt from Discovery. Uh -huh. Skirt from Zara. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Shoes from Forever Twenty One. Uh -huh. Purses Prada. Yes. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Do a little spin. A little spin for the win. Let's see the whole. Yes, girl. Oh, yeah, she's so cute. Just cut me out. <laughs> she's so cute. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, Outfit check. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know what none of this is from, so I ain't even gonna fake y'all. <laughs> the glasses is from Gucci. These mm -hmm. earrings, I'm pretty sure they're from the beauty supply. The boo got me the necklace. This shirt is from Fashion House. These shorts is from Fashion Nova. My Tory Burch purse, and I got these shoes from, um, I don't know, but I'm ashy, so I don't get my kneecaps. Really. And body is Texas bread. Period. <laughs> Shein and then just you know go bracelets all from I think Shein and Cartier and 
Aaron's machine. Uh huh. Hey, Cartier, she said so loosely. Yes, yeah, Cartier. <laughs> but, um, that Chanel bag, I love. Thank you. It's their, um, Shine in the nighttime. I'm a vampire, but I don't bite. Come inside when it's daylight, but please don't waste my time. I'm timeless, I can't lie. I bet I can hit it, give me one night. If I see the right line. Wipe her out. Eat her burger. So she can do the driving. Yeah. We was going to the after hour and then we changed our mind. We finished all that liquor. Oh, we did. Uh, no, we did. We, we finished all the liquor. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we definitely had a time. Mm-hmm. I'm drunk. I'm drunk. I'm drunk. I'm drunk. Oh my. Oh fuck. Oh my god. Mm. I just had to make myself throw up. Trying to make yourself throw up. Terrible. Top five of the most terrible things you gotta do. Oh my god. Ugh. Okay, hold on. Let me put my pajamas on. Cut. Oh, okay. Thank you, Lord. Oh, okay. I feel like. I done been drunk before to where I can't sit up, I can't look at light, I can't do nothing. This 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 drunkness feels more like I'm like motion sickness, seasick, car sick. Porsche's friends were so cool. Mercedes and Yasmin, super cool. They're gonna be on the boat party tomorrow. Oh Lord. And they both said, Gina, we thought you was tall. We thought you was like a tall stallion. You are not tall. My doctor told me I'm five nine. One of them, I think Yasmin, she's five seven. And we was like the same height, which is so crazy. Every time I meet like subscribers in person, they're always like, You're not that tall. My doctor told me I'm five nine, so <laughs> Unless the older I get, the more I shrink. Okay, y'all. Face is clean. I'm still f even though I threw up. We're about to go to sleep. So I will catch y'all in the morning. I hope I wake up on time. The dead has arisen. I'm surprised I'm up this early. I've actually been up for about 45 minutes. Oh, last night was so fun. Oh, we're gonna do it all over again today. I hear that they're up, uh, they up working, so I'm about to go in the kitchen, help them get the stuff prepared for, um, what you call it? I can't even think straight. Uh, the boat party today. Oh, Lord. I'm gonna need some Advil before I start drinking again. Y'all push the so creative. Look at these charcuterie cups. These are all the stuff we're taking with us on the boat. Uh, hey, Gosey. Hey, Gosey. <laughs> Just straighten up. Now it's time to pick out. So, hot pink is our color. So, this is the bathing suit that I got to wear. This little monokini. Go like this, like that, like that. But if that don't look right, then I, this is my backup. But I don't wanna wear this one. But I will if I have to, so. 
And then I brought this cover up. I think y'all were with, were y'all with me? But anyways, I got this from Zara. It was $19.99. It's a silver mesh dress. And if I don't like that, then I just have my old faithful. I've had this for years. Just these shorts and top. I forgot I also brought this cover up top. I forgot I brought this one. It's just like a sheer oversized shirt. Come down to my knees almost. Okay, I got options. I. Okay, I'm just putting a little shine on my body. This is my highlighter. So I'm just, I don't know. When I go to like water beaches, I want to look bronzy. And then this is Soleil Decade from Zara. This is going to be my first time using it. Because y'all know I usually use the Tom Ford. So let's see. It's definitely it's more subtle than the Tom Ford, but it's still gonna get the job done. And it's way cheaper. I need to shave these leaves. I only grow because I had laser hair removal many, many, many years ago, like 12 years ago. So I only grow like eight to 10 hairs on each leg, but them eight to 10 hairs is showing. <laughs> I literally only have to shave my legs like three or four times a year. It's crazy. <laughs> we made the child. There's Yasmin, Kia, and Lily. Of course, she went to park the car. Right. You got it, Kia? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can pull it. I'm holding these cute little thingies. We're at the beach, so who cares? They barbecue on our head smells so good. It feels good, it smells good. And I said, you know it. In the, in the back seat of that car, I said, I'm not about to talk to nobody. I said, because if I make the wrong move, or I feel like I'm a, yeah. Oh, in the car, baby, I was waving, like we was on a pool. That's like, how I feel, yeah. Yes. That's how I feel too. Y'all, we done made it to the pier. Look, we've been carrying stuff. We're trying to figure out where they at. Kia, we told her. Jay, we got to She got to be white. Ooh, body goes. Yeah, I'm trying. Body goes. Oh, look at that body. Yeah, the bees and the wasp been trying to attack us. I don't know if it's because we hold them food or what. We got the most pets, y'all. We got the most pets. Okay. Yeah, we got the most pets. 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 Yeah, we got the Finally made it to our dock. They got that big yacht down there. Y'all can see the two-story one. Yeah, I'm, I'm not ahead of like oh. that. <laughs> yeah, I got um. What up? <laughs> all right, so um. Look at all the ladies here with their pink on. All the Barbies. Yes, and our Barbie. captain. Our captain looks 21. <laughs> Why our captain looks so young? Yes. I go over there with her. Hey, I, I feel like I know you because I watch you so much, so don't worry about it. I feel like I know you. So cute. Oh, I'm sorry. We taking off. My It ain't gonna fit. It ain't gonna fit on her head. Not on my arm. Oh, my head too big. Let the party begin. Oh, coconut 18 ounces? That sounds good. Okay, there's a douce. There's wine. But everything else is tequila. I mean, I'm, 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 I'm going to fuck with it. <laughs> yeah. Take it off your wrist because I just spilled my whole shot on it. Because you can't fill it up to the hole. I have to take it. Thank you. That's enough. Yeah, that's good, boo. Thank you. Bye. Bye. We lit. Okay. Yeah. Bye. 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 Bye.
like a nail hole. It's okay. You got it. I got It seems like everybody in all these boats is too quiet. Everybody just looking at all the boats. Even the black people. Yeah. Well, it's Saturday. Come relax on a Sunday. Yeah. Right. 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 They pay with me though. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. They ain't counting. You're like seven minutes. Seven minutes. Seven minutes. Seven minutes. Oh, no, we got it. We need a group picture. No, Did you like yours? We got to get it. Up. Wait, yeah, you can give it to me. Oh, I'll take it. Go ahead and get a shot. I'll set it back up. What's up, y'all? These are my new right here. Period. Yeah. 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 Only for five minutes, <laughs> then they can't have her no more. What is this pussy? Collie green. boat y'all but we about to do a, a champagne toast well we are wine and champagne i'm i'm more of a wine person okay well let's, let's, let's get some of this thank you so we doing like wine and champagne with cotton candy y'all we have so much food left over uh they started giving it to the people who was just like in the picnic areas we got the cupcakes away the sandwiches we gave all the food away we ain't giving a lick away though no, I'm not talking about like this, y'all. Come on. Yes. Okay, come on. Now, Portia, okay. do you have your cup? Yeah, yeah. You do? Okay. Uh, All right. Okay, one thing. Y'all You do? Oh, yeah. Like oh, yeah. Like oh, and they know. They know. Well, yes. I, I Thank mean. Thank you, Portia, for putting this together. I mean, yeah. Uh, I, yeah, for the boat. But we mean, period. When we meet up, it be the same. All these ladies. The influencers. I think I'm, I think I'm no weird shit. Kind of Everybody bad. cool. Everybody was cool. Yeah, yeah. Um, my name is Portia Nicole. Period. You ready? Yes. Yes. Cheers to the freaking Hello. weekend. Cheers to the freaking weekend. Good, right there. Bam. Thank you. Yeah, I need a little bit more. That's sweetness. Okay. Cute. Okay, now we got cheers with you. Yeah. 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 I got on camera, yes. Okay. Cheers. That's good, yeah. I would like it with champagne. Yeah. Oh, y'all, we back at the Casa. We got some Portillo's. I don't know if Portillo's is just a Chicago uh, restaurant or if they everywhere. I got an Italian beef. And I got a Chicago style hot dog. Uh oh. Oh, Lord. Chicago style hot dog. You got tomato, onions. A whole pickle spear, peppers, mustard, yeah. What the hell is this green stuff? Is that onion? Do I like the bell pepper? Probably so. I don't think I like this. This well, is good. Oh, because oh, you got everything on yours. I don't think I like that. Mm -mm. Is that what it is? Yeah, it's just a, it's a lot going on. Let me try this sandwich. <laughs> it must be because you got it. We're going to slide that over to the side. It must be because you got everything, everything on it. Everything on it. I was like, I want to taste it. How come I had a, uh, a Chicago style hot dog in decades? This is a chili cheese dog. Good. It's good. Girl, then I got this sandwich dipped and it looked like it's soaking wet. Like I ain't. It would be. 
Because it's dipped. Oh, Lord. But that's how they eat it. It is literally soaking wet. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Dude. It's not bad, but I don't think I would have. This just okay. I'm still mad about that damn Portillo's. Okay. I I had Portillo's like when I was a kid, and I don't remember if I liked it or not, but I know I've had it before. But as an adult, that no, it's not good. Let me not say it's not good. It's, it's not good to me. I'm, I'm going to say that. But I was expecting something just totally different. So anyways, I'm still hungry. That's just that. Um, I'm packing up now. About to pack, take a shower, and probably lay down. We might go to this little sports bar that's over here later. But I doubt it. It's like 10, 20. And by the time I'm done packing... Let me put y'all down here. By the time I'm done packing and showered and all that good stuff, it's going to be late as hell. I'm telling y'all, this I'm not going out of town for a while. I, next time I go out of town, I don't want to go out of town the rest of the August or September. I want to go back out of town in like October, November. I need to chill. My body is so tired. I'm just so tired from traveling. Just, it's a lot. Packing, unpacking, flights, being in the airport, the money, expenses. Like, it's, it's just a lot. So, I got friends coming in town. I want to say, what is it, next weekend? I got people coming in town in September. So... Yeah, I'm 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 chilling for now, y'all. <laughs> but I did say that I want to say, didn't I say that in July? And wind up traveling three times in July. 